Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you happen to be new here, welcome to the Painted South. I think that moving is always bittersweet. As the house gets emptied, there's always a touch of sadness. We've had five years of memories in this house. I will miss so many things about this house. I loved the way the sun would shine through the trees in the afternoon. The little birds that would fly through the windows. The families of deer that played in our yard and in the neighborhood. and even the feeling of being home as soon as you turned into the driveway. However, it was our time to move on and time to pass the keys to another family. As many of you probably know for yourselves, packing always starts off very thoughtfully. Each piece is wrapped, boxed, and labeled. After a while, you just have to get it done. All right, I just finished loading the second pod and the guy's on his way to pick it up. It wasn't 100% full, but it was as full as we could get it before they got here. And now I have to figure out what we're gonna do with the rest of this stuff. It is probably about 99 degrees outside. It is so hot and humid and it's almost 2 p.m. So. I'm going to take a break after they pick up this pod and then get back at it. We searched for months for a new house. We wanted land and privacy, but not endless yard work. And we wanted a house that wasn't falling apart. My husband really wanted a pond and a creek, and this one had both, but it was just altogether way too much work for us. So then one day, a property popped up for sale and it was a couple of hours away. It had the acreage that we wanted and that acreage was all wooded. The house was very dated, but it was just the right size. It was all on one level except for a bonus room over the garage. 
So when we got there and looked at it, there were already two offers on the table. Our offer ended up being one of 12. And so we ended up buying the house and here we are at our new home, surrounded by trees with just a small yard to take care of. Which is a good thing because the inside needs an enormous amount of work. So this footage is actually from our showing appointment. We were mainly looking at the floor plan, size of the rooms, and overall functionality for the way we actually live each day. So as you can obviously see, this house needs a lot of updating. There is texture on the ceilings. There are fluorescent lights in the kitchen. 90 ceiling fans, and so much more that needs to be updated. But since we were downsizing from a much larger home, we had to keep an open mind. As you're walking through with me on this tour, if you have any ideas, I would love to hear them in the comment section below. If anyone wants any of these awesome curtains, I'd be happy to send them to you. Just kidding, they're already in the trash. I am so happy to finally be back on YouTube sharing videos with you all. I've been wanting to do this for weeks. I wish you guys knew all that we've been through to get to this point. It has been quite the journey and there's a lot more going on that I haven't told you about that hopefully I'll get to in another video, but I just wanted to share this with you. We are finally in our new home and I am so excited to start getting things done and turning this into the place that we envisioned it to be. Now as for this bonus room over the garage, the blue carpet has to go for sure, but I'm not sure if I'm going to use this for my crafting room or as the guest room. So as you can tell, I'm going to have a lot of renovation, decorating, DIY videos, crafting videos, all of that ahead. If you would like to follow along, please consider subscribing to my channel. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. It will help me get back with the algorithm on YouTube since I've been absent for a little while. And if you like crafting and seasonal decorating, definitely be sure to follow me here and on Instagram. I have lots to share with you coming up soon. As always, thank you so much for watching. Please take care of yourselves and I will see you in the next video.